That money clip us now, the new now looks like Whoa, upgrade my All right, welcome back everybody and thank you so much for being here. If this is your first time here, I make videos just like this one to simplify your gaming experience. Now, before we get started, I do wanna talk about this little guy and what it is. This isn't quite a sponsored video, but um, just so that we can give full disclosure, um, I did go onto Amazon and purchase this battery pack from Smatry, 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 uh, not really sure how to pronounce your company, uh, but S-M-A-T-R-E-E. -E. And uh, after I bought it, they went ahead and reimbursed me with a gift card uh, to do a review of this particular battery pack. So uh, guys, just wanna give you that full disclosure. And so we'll go ahead and get jumped into uh, exactly what this guy is. But before we get started, if you found, you wanna go ahead and give this guy a shot. I have left the links in the description below where you can find this particular battery pack at. And so for today, I just wanna show you the product and kind of go over the basic features. But if you'd like to know how the batteries hold up after a while, then maybe we can do a follow-up video, perhaps like a month down the road and let you know how it worked after like a month of usage time and such. All right, so let's go ahead and open up this box and see what they look like, get some first impressions of just the basic batteries and then we'll go from there, okay? So let's open this up here. All right, and so as you can see here, here's the packaging of the product and it comes with what looks like the battery charger pack and then also your two separate small batteries. So let's go ahead and take those out of the casings and the wrappers. And then also lastly, it does come with your USB charging kit. All right, so let's go ahead and get these out of the wrappers. And here you go, this is what it looks like. So, you know, nothing too, too fancy. Nice sleek black look, kind of a sleek logo there. So that's what the name of the company is. And according to Smotry, these batteries do have a 48 hour battery lifespan. They do obviously come with the backup charger, which we already showed you. Uh, and it works with all Xbox One and Xbox Series X controllers. So that's nice if you have a mixture of Xbox One and Xbox Series X controllers for your new console. Or maybe, you know, you still have an Xbox One console and you have this guys so you'll be able to use both of those at the same time all right and so once you put the battery pack in here and you're charging it it does have an indicator light on it which will turn green when the battery is fully charged as well it does have an overcharge protection so that once the battery is fully charged and you see that green light uh, maybe you're not at home maybe you're charging overnight the overcharge protection should turn off the charging on the battery so that you don't overcharge the battery and you don't ruin the battery lifespan now one quick tip of the day that i did find when i was researching a little bit about these batteries is there were a few comments on there kind of complaining about the battery lifespan of these particular batteries and one of the commenters actually mentioned that a lot of people were doing it wrong, right? So when you first get these batteries out, the first thing you don't wanna do is go put it right into your controller and then play it. And then in like an hour later, it, it dies, right? So what you wanna do first is go ahead and put both of your batteries in here plug it into your wall, let them charge for around six hours, get fully charged. And then what you'll need to do is once you put it in your controller, you know, don't use it for a day and then put it back into the charger. You wanna make sure that you go ahead and put it in your controller, use it until it's completely dead, take out the second battery pack, put that back in your controller and put the dead one back in the charger, let it charge for the six hours and then unplug it. Now, one thing that Smatry does mention when it comes to your overcharge protection with this particular thing is that if for some reason your charging was interrupted, then it actually starts to count over for the seven hours of charge time. So I don't know how that necessarily would affect, you know, in case it would start overcharging. Um, but, you know, I don't know if it's something around like six hours and then you get an over uh, some sort of malfunction and then you need to restart it and it resets the timer. I don't know if that would end up going to overcharging. So, um, you know, keep that in mind, guys, that that is a possibility when using these. And so lastly, just quickly, I'd like to give you my thoughts on these battery packs. Now, I can't recommend these yet because I haven't actually used them, but, you know, Looks pretty cool, sleek design. I think it's gonna work just fine in your controller, um, but I would like to get some usage underneath these before I do state whether I would recommend these or not recommend these battery packs. Now I have come from using a Microsoft battery pack on my Xbox One that I've had for, I think, what, four to five, maybe even six years now at least. And that battery pack is still going really strong with some good charges. Now I really only use my controller two to three hours a night. So maybe that's part of why, but it still hasn't really like really lost its battery life. So going from that to this, I'd like to get a comparison on that. So before I can recommend those, um, I'm gonna get some playtime in these. And then, like I said, if you would like to see a full on review of the how the batteries lasted and stuff, uh, please let me know in the comments below. And with that guys, as always, thank you so much for watching today and I will see you in the next one.